Hello and welcome to the next part of Danganronpa Another. Last time we were so close to finding the presumed 16 student hidden somewhere inside the school. But then Monokuma decided to be a major party pooper. And we aren't allowed to see that guy anymore, so... Yeah. That's my private basement, no one's allowed down there. <laughs> and that's being... A party pooper. Let us, yeah. <laughs> let us see the fun basement. <laughs> anyway... <laughs> Sorry, I just had a good Monokuma line. I was just like, I'm just gonna do it. Fuck. I mean, Why I not? also had this introduction in my head for an hour, so I needed to do it. <laughs> That's fine. Alrighty then, now we gotta test our Uehara and first find him. Yeah, finding him would be good. <laughs> ah. Alrighty then. Ah, by the way, why, while we're looking for the priest, I can tell you this one story. Yes, I want to hear this. I've been waiting for days. <laughs> So, yeah, I once accidentally embarrassed a friend of mine by, well, uh, I was drunk and when I'm, when I get drunk, my this is dirty stuff sensor just gives up on, like, checking <laughs> what I'm thinking. No filter. Yeah. It's gone. <laughs> the filter is just gone and things happen when that happens. Anyway. It was the birthday party of uh, my good friend. He is the only mm -hmm. guy in our friend group. But he also has other guy friends and it was the end of the birthday party. So he was saying goodbye to some other girl and it took a while. Mm -hmm. And one of his guy friends was making fun of him for that. So he said dramatically to me and my sister who would go uh, go home next so he said to us so yeah sadly you won't get such a intimate one-on-one -on -one goodbye like that girl yeah <laughs> and little drunk me with the innocence of thousand lambs said then to him oh no problem we can share him Incredible. Oh, we found him. Yes. Excellent. And this is a is this a Christian Minecraft server. We have to behave now. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> and like with perfect timing, one of my friends who stood right beside me was like, oh that sounded kinda wrong. She was also drunk. <laughs> and then I was like, oh no that you say it? <laughs> So yeah, <laughs> not many brain cells were active that day. Oh fuck, that took me the hell out. Oh my god. <laughs> and apparently oh. his guy friend was decent enough to not tell him that. Oh my god, that's funny. <laughs> so, a year later while drinking, we were all together and I somehow got the idea again and I remembered what I said back then and decided to bring up bring it up oh no so I told him the story again and yeah I think the poor guy was embarrassed <laughs> when he heard it because he put his head into his hands and then his hands on the table and he did not look up for solid five minutes <laughs> process it anymore he's like i need to check out <laughs> yep and meanwhile, oh my god 
The others, despite having been there when I said it, also lost their shit exactly like you just did. <laughs> That's excellent! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> and I also just remembered another thing I subjected the poor guy to. Because sometimes I fulfill the uh, stereotype of the innocent asexual. Yeah. <laughs> I asked him in high school what fisting is. No! <laughs> oh my god, no! <laughs> and he had to explain it to me. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. But you need to tell me how that played out. Because, like, was he able to just roll it off and actually, like... Explain it, or was he like tripping over himself? Because that's that's a hilarious image. <laughs> he was trying his best to give me an explanation without going to graphic. <laughs> Fucking birds and the bees talk, <laughs> but from your best friend, <laughs> and it's about a fucking cake instead. <laughs> uh, pretty much. I mean, thankfully, I am not, like, uh, slow, so I do... I did get the direction it was going oh, pretty you, fast. Oh, you picked up on it pretty early. I mean, I knew it was probably sexual, and if I don't know a sexual word, I always make a point to ask my friends. Because they do such a good job explaining it to me without going too graphic, and I don't have to Google it. So you're just like, all right, sexual encyclopedias activate. <laughs> yep. And also, it is kind of fun seeing them struggle to explain sexual stuff to me. I must, I must say. Okay, okay, okay. I have to capitalize on that statement because you're like, man, I really am a sadist, and now I'm gesturing to that because I'm just like, you didn't realize this sooner. How? <laughs> I mean. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I really don't know that kind of stuff, so I need someone to explain it to me. It's just a bonus that they are struggling <laughs> while <laughs> explaining it. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> All right. Okay. <laughs> now that we got our uh, mouth muscles moving, let's uh, not um, keep Uehara waiting much longer. He's probably giving, like, realistically, if he heard this conversation, he'd give the most sidelong neutral glance and then just, like, this this sigh of judgment as he just turns away. Absolutely. <laughs> he now knows things he never wanted to know. <laughs> this is true. All right. Ah, uh, yeah. I knew it would be in Korean. <laughs> uh, yes, yes. There's, um, two people working on the, uh, translation for- the translation and the localization for, uh, the remake hmm. that, um, like with- uh, with the rest of another team that's helping with that. And the- nicely enough, the, uh, the free time events actually are- Loosely translated on YouTube. Hmm. They're just a little messy. So if you are ever curious about someone, I can link you one later. <laughs> you cannot tell me that and expect me not to want to see <laughs> stuff. No, I know. <laughs> Alrighty then. You're just like, you're just like, Yen, where the hell is Ray? And I'm like, I'll get it later. <laughs> I mean... Did you expect anything else from me? No. <laughs> it's exactly what I was what I was expecting, and that's fine. All right, where the heck is Uehara? I don't know. Where did he go? <laughs> Maybe the. Mm. Where is Hello, the man's Satsuki. Satsuki? He likes. Okay, I didn't art, expect apparently. to find him in here. <laughs> hmm. That doesn't surprise me, considering that like. <clears throat> uh, like, uh, uh re re religious individuals really like the art that people make hmm. for, like, their, you know, stuff. So that really doesn't shock me, considering he seems to be re 
resemblant of a Catholic priest, so that scans. <laughs> All right, what do you like? What do you like? I think we have like a cross or something. Yeah, I think we should have. Ah, and the Bible. Oh, we have a Bible. <laughs> <laughs> so many choices. We have Bible and crosses, so I think he'll take either of those. <laughs> Let's see if it. Yes, it's saved. Oh. Three times over. It's probably what it was saying. Well, at least the day is over. Maybe free mm -hmm. time goes on next day. Everyone's relationship with me has remained the same since this morning. So you had no progress with Uehara? That is unfortunate. <laughs> yes. I haven't seen any new clues to make this argument change at all. But tomorrow I'm sure I'll find something. I'll believe in that chance. When your head is so dizzy and difficult to even organize my thoughts, it's best to forget everything and sleep. If you can sleep, then that's fortunate. Yes. I was hoping for a better tomorrow and sleep for now. There were still a few rules that Kinjo originally set when he was the leader. One is having breakfast together, and the other is to not leave our rooms at night. However, Kinjo, the one who set the rules, has left on his own, and I'm also suspected of being an imposter, so I was kicked out from the group. But nevertheless, I decided to follow my will. I think everyone will make that decision soon too. Then I'll go to the restaurant tomorrow morning to have a meal, and, I, and if I keep talking with them, I'm sure they'll start believing in me. You are such an optimistic soul. Too optimistic, considering the circumstances. Yeah, a bit. Optimistic to the point of lacking realism. Sometimes you gotta just escape reality a bit. Yeah. Lying in a bed without feeling good, and not feeling much like sleeping, but I spent a whole day looking around to investigate, and soon I fell into a deep sleep. Yes, finally it is all over with this. Red text again. Everything, it's over. All of it will end. This is despair. But you have such a great despair. So I will follow you always. Uh, interesting dialogue? Mm hmm. Yuki, you aren't like a despair follower, are you? <laughs> Or the mastermind really likes him. So <laughs> sus. Yes. Mm -hmm. Morning? I think I just had some strange dream. Yeah, yeah. Doesn't matter. Let's go to the dining room first, and once again, this time, I'm going to convince everyone. Good luck with that, my friend. Yeah. The first thing I noticed as soon as I entered di the dining room was her appearance. Do, do we finally get to see Akane again? Akane. It's, it's been a while. In like days. There she is. She's there. <laughs> Tyra. Oh my. <laughs> Shit. Hmm. She definitely still needs therapy. She needs time. Like, she needs time because there is no therapy here. But she needs, she needs time to digest. 
time and probably and a com support system. Yes, yes, companionship, please. Yuki. Yuki, go help her. She's literally been hitting on you since day one. If you don't do anything, my opinion of you is going to go down lower than it already is. <laughs> Yuki, you gotta at least try to be a good harem protagonist, please. <laughs> yeah. Thank god, you're out of the room. For a moment I thought this was a fortunate moment, but as soon as I realized that but I soon realized that Tyra's condition was a little different than usual. She looks dead. Tyra has been in that state since this morning. She came here faster than anyone and I thought she recovered. Oh, the greeting is late. Good morning, Maeda. Good morning. It, it's not... Why is Maeda naturally joining the meal in the morning? Do you know you promised him something? I'm gonna yeet Haru at one of the plated windows. Hope that he dents it and that the window cracks. <laughs> I mean, maybe he remembers this promise then. I sure hope so. Or I'm gonna beat him up. <laughs> hmm. Th that's right. How many times is this gonna happen? We can't do activities with... Can't. It's an interesting word choice. You just can't don't want to. It is an interesting word choice. Imposters that know the mastermind. You could if you weren't a fucking coward. I mean, to be fair, Teria really is, like, laced in cowardice. Yes. I do like him sometimes, but he... He has a habit of just overreacting. Yeah. I mean, he <laughs> will get better once this whole stupid drama blows over. I don't think they're gonna drag this on for the entire game. It's like I think the... it's a chapter-oriented thing, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't think it will go on to the next chapter. And even if, then the dynamic will definitely have already changed by then. Yeah. You don't really believe that. Of course we do. No matter how much of a good guy Mida is... He has good behavior. And he has shown great success in the class trials. He takes good care of others, and... Did, did, did you... Did you want to crit criticize him, or are you just praising him? I think he's getting there. <laughs> but I think he's outwardly conflicted. <laughs> he's a nice and funny guy, too. No. <laughs> like, so where are you going with this, babe? <laughs> yep. So what's so bad about Yuki? Yeah, so many good points on him. Patience, please. <laughs> Anyways, I can't accept Mida right away. With the big question left behind in the air. Mikako, babe, help. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, how can you trust me, then? Well, if there's evidence that makes Maida clear they're not an imposter, then... That's impossible to prove. It is. All I can do is claim my innocence. Whether you believe in me or not. Depends on how much you side with Monokuma's tricks. Oh, nice, uh, Uno Reverse. Ooh, that is such a backhanded comment. Like, I get where he's coming from, but that is such a backhanded comment. <laughs> it's very fair. I mean, he... I would be pettier than him in his situation, so he's allowed this much pettiness. Yeah, I... I yeah. The room went silent. Everyone seemed to be hesitating in some way, 
but it seemed that they couldn't quite decide. Hey, what are you guys so worried about? Huh? Even if, even if you say that Yuki is the one who knows the mastermind, you're not on the mastermind, right? After all, the bad person is the mastermind in the end. And if you guys really like Yuki, can't you guys just get along with him or whatever? Satsuki is the MVP. Satsuki has very high emotional intelligence. Mm. Like, like, okay. I'll, I'll cave and say that, like, she is not the brightest bulb, but she has very high emotional intelligence. She was even able to, like, pinpoint in the gambling room about Yuki that, like, hey, if you try this w with us, we'll give you a chance. Like, that was her suggestion, because she wanted to have, like, basically a small group interaction with him, with Haru there, to kind of gauge, like, how he is. Hmm. And one of the best ways to do that is playing a card game. Poker. Because, like, you know, poker face. And I'm just like, she has really high emotional intelligence, and I hope other people realize that. Hmm, hmm. What? Man, that's so easy to say. Means that you're on the side of the mastermind, then. That's a leap. It is a leap. A you know her better than that, Haru. Shut up. <laughs> a leap of faith that goes to nowhere. True. Can we trust a person like that? Then we just have to be better than the mastermind and make the impossible betray them. Good logic. I love her. <laughs> I mean, I wish sometimes people had this mindset because... Imposters, or uh, rather traitors, are very interesting characters, and it's more interesting when mm -hmm. not the entire group rejects them. Yeah, I agree. Especially when she's like, well, then we'll just convince him not to side with that dude anymore, and I'm like, yes! <laughs> yes, I <laughs> Even will. if you, like, it's like you're wrong, but you have spirit. <laughs> I'm like, even if they you know? fail, it will make for fun drama. Exactly. Iranami. Make them betray the mastermind? I like Yuki a lot. Isn't that the same for you guys? That's... I do, but... Then, it's decided. Don't bother him. Or whatever, just be a friend. If I suspect someone I like, it just makes my head hurt. I guess Iranami is not someone who's aiming for words or thinking too deeply. She just said something that she wanted to say. Entirely purely. And such words coming from I Iranami moved everyone's hearts. Ah, okay. Fine, I lost. Kobashikawa? Let's just talk to him, rather than worrying about him, for whatever reason, I think. It would be better if we stay together. Thank you for seeing reason. Yeah, I don't have to throw you against a window anymore. Congrats. <laughs> Satsuki MVP. Yes. He's just like, ugh, the girl I like is spitting <laughs> sense. I have to agree. <laughs> yes, Iranami's words are the right answer. Hikako. Yeah, rather than staying away from Maida and regretting it, regretting even if he turns out to be an imposter, there's less to regret by being together, I think. Indeed. Yeah, let's just act with Maida like usual. But are you really okay with that? What if I really become a traitor? It is, I must say, generally more... Well, like, it would weigh less on my conscience to uh, get betrayed by someone I trusted rather than 
turning someone away who in the end doesn't turn out to be a traitor. Yeah. Agreed. Now, if you say it like that, you don't feel like you're you're a part of it? You'll just have to accept it too. I believe we did this wrong from the beginning. Thank you. You guys. Oh, but only Maida. Kinjo will never be accepted. There's no exception. Understandable. Brain cells! I like you! <laughs> that, that's right. There's no way we will be able to talk to him. In the end, everyone believed me. Because it, because it was Iranami, where words came before thinking. Actually, this would have happened too if the others fought like Iranami. Little by little, I'm regaining my trust again. It was the first and foremost step towards a goal to escape. Now that I'm back with you guys, I was curious about something. Well, being all gathered in the morning like this means that you are going to continue with Kinjo's rules. Kinjo is someone I don't really like, but he sure does know how to maintain safety. Before Maeda came in, I was about to check the number of people and have breakfast. Man, I'm so hungry! <laughs> Alright. Then let's continue to have breakfast together and not come out at night time. Can can someone like give her a hug or something? Sasuke, you're right there. You're like the best person to give her a hug. <laughs> yeah. Still no response from her. I don't think she even noticed Maida coming in. That's <clears throat> Does Yuki wanna know what we've been doing before you came? Uh, well, the secret stairs that Kurokawa showed yesterday, we also talked about Kinjo and Maeda. I couldn't pretend to hear it. Uh, she must have been shot because of Hatano. Hatano. Boy. She said something? Ah, uh, yes. When it comes to the name Hatano, she reacts like that shortly. But after that, she goes back to being silent. Inori, weren't you a doctor of some kind? How can we treat her? I... Surgeons and mental health are not the same, my guy. <laughs> yeah, there, there's a reason you need to study different things for that. Mm -hmm. Actually, I'm not a doctor, but a surgeon. You could say I'm the kind that heals physical wounds. However, I don't have the ability to heal such wounds from the heart. That should be seen by a psychiatrist. <laughs> For some reason, there seems to be two Karakawas now. That's, Buddy, that's that's a bad not the joke. time. Bad joke. No, no, no. <laughs> you gotta stop. See, she's also offended. Why? Why would you? Why would you hurt her like this? She did nothing. <laughs> yeah, literally. Sho Kobashikawa, don't make jokes like that. I, I was. S sorry, I'm sorry, okay? Listen, Haru, you have some brain cells, but you need you need to you need to you need to you need to work them out a little bit more. <laughs> I guess that's something the girls hate when I say that about Kurokawa. I think guys would hate that too. I think everyone hates that, Haru. <laughs> Or are they just like hitting me? No, you're being a dumbass! There's a difference! Ay, ay, ay. 
Inori, we have to do that one more time. Sure. That was cute. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh? Ah, so sorry. I usually have a habit to stop patients like that. What? What? I, I hold her gently in my hands. She's so adorable. <laughs> Why do you hit your patients? I... Was she hitting them? Oh, wait, yeah, she was. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> Harate chop. Yeah? And, okay, wait, but Haru's, like, tall, too, and she's so tiny, so that's probably hilarious to watch. It probably is. That's so funny. Also, apparently, uh, Inori is uh, Lloyd Forger from Spy X Family. Please forget it because it's embarrassing. It seems the mood is more relaxed than yesterday. Feeling the air lighter, we decided to begin our breakfast. After breakfast, we started to investigate again. Investigating was important, but I was also worried about Tyra. Once she tried to eat her meal, even if it was burned, she continued to eat in that waste in that wasteful bowl or even put water in it, etc. She was in a bad condition. She couldn't even think herself. But what can we even do with our own power? There was nothing we could do to ease her pain, but we decided to wait for time to heal her. If we get out of this terrible place, we'll be able to make some progress. Let's do a little more research and look for clues. Morning. Oh boy. They're always in the same room together. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this room didn't. Like, I remember him having that notification before. Uh, that we found that we found that door, but we can't enter it. Yeah, but we it still hasn't become relevant Yeah, I'm kind of wondering why <laughs> I was originally expecting it to come up in a trial or be important for that, but Yeah Kenji, where are you? <laughs> in an uh, somewhere obscure it seems uh, yeah. <laughs> what is he doing there? <laughs> he was there Sir? The time. How the heck did Sir? I not see you? <laughs> he, to be fair, he's very white. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Black and white isn't exactly the best color scheme to stand out. No, it's not. Good, Ahara, can we have your skill, please? Jesus Christ! Uh, oh! What are we doing here? Oh, this is his room! <laughs> yes. This is his room! This is what I meant! All the characters have themed rooms! Lord howdy, if you ever see Sarugi's. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm Marina, all... it has... It has... It has... Jail bars and handcuffs and stuff all over the floor. <laughs> we should use his, his room sometimes. Exactly! <laughs> uh, not gonna lie, this room already weirds me out. God, me! I walked in and I was like, I wanna leave. Can I leave? <laughs> yeah, I. Uh... My first reaction was yelling out Jesus Christ, so... <laughs> Not... Oh, he's smiling. What? What? He was smiling? I didn't see. God damn it. It was extremely subtle. He yeah. actually had a sprite of him with this extremely subtle smile. I'm like, oh, that's, that's a look I've never seen on you. <laughs> 
Man, they could be having the gayest conversation ever and we wouldn't know. <laughs> I can get you his free time event later if you want to see it. <laughs> I mean, it probably uh, won't do justice to what I just said, but... True. <laughs> Police boy might be up to the challenge, though. Yeah. <laughs> it's actually kind of... They, this this room would freak me out if I slept in here, okay? The angel statues especially because of, like, weeping angel feel. No thanks. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even have, like, that one phobia of, like, uh, mannequins or, like, still objects or whatever because I own dolls. Mm. I literally own dolls, so it doesn't bug me. But, like, the idea of, like, angel statues, sleeping in the, the same room with angel statues, just no, no, mm-mm, mm, -mm, mm, -mm no. <laughs> I once freaked out while sleeping over at a friend's house because they had like clothes over a chair and in the dark it looked like mm -hmm. a person so I don't think it would be wise for me to sleep in a room with Man, that must have been piled high! <laughs> yeah, that uh, I was very afraid. <laughs> I don't know what I saw in Rena's there, Rena's just but... like, I'm not going home tonight, am I? <laughs> It was scary, but I don't know what my sleep drunken self saw there anymore. <laughs> it's been a while. Yeah. There, there, that's there's, a smile. There's, uh, yeah, so he has two different ones. He had one with his eyes open and one with it closed. It's so subtle that if you're just skipping, you won't notice it. <laughs> mm. What are you two talking about? <laughs> Something deep and philosophical, perhaps. <laughs> Smiling a lot, though. Yeah, he is. Why? My guy. What is on your mind? <laughs> Yuki, what are you saying to him? This is such an ugly cross, though. It is. I think Jesus would hate it. Yeah. Did I just get a skill? I think you did, yeah. Alright, let's... Ah, uh, why does... Maybe not. Hmm. Where do the... Where are the skills anyway? Because you bought keys on us. Maybe we only get them... Later. Like, before the class trials, only then we get to see them, maybe? I don't... know. Mm. But maybe to be sure, we should still hang out with him. Yeah, you can try it one more time. Because... <laughs> I'll be honest. When we max them out, we get their underwear. <laughs> of course we do! You think Linus would leave that out? Nah, he's just like, alright, take it. <laughs> I can't wait to see it. Uh. <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of... Why are these two in, in a room alone? Why are these two in a room together? That's... Mm. <laughs> what is happening? Seriously, these two should not be alone in the same room together. Uh, maybe in the art room again? Ah, there you are. Thank you for making my job easier. Now yep. he's smiling directly. Yep. I want to know why you two are getting along so well now. Fuck me too. Then I <laughs> okay! I mean, it's normal looking. There's nothing to be ashamed of. They're like... They're like the cinched boxer briefs, you know, mm. with like the, with like the, um, you probably wouldn't know this actually. They're the, like with the, like, like with l elastic and then the tops like kind of frayed. That, mm -hmm. that does fit him, I guess. <laughs> I mean, it looks God. normal enough. 
Now give yeah, me something they're, they're like pretty normal. Give me something like uh, Togami's Fong again, and I will make fun of it for years. You need to see Terrius everywhere then. <laughs> oh no! Does he have a Fong too? <laughs> he um, he has you know. <laughs> <sighs> but why did I get... Uh, I am confused why I... I mean, we have one more gift to give him, so we... Because we're not going to do anything else with it. Yeah. I'm just confused why he he gave us his underwear in advance. Just like here. <laughs> do with do with it whatever you wish. What? I mean that's the that's the message. It, it, it is. It, it it really it really it really is. Oh. Plot. Yeah, I think it's plot. That's Kurukawa. What is she doing there? Kurukawa, what are you doing? Maeda. I was looking at... ceiling? Are you looking at ghost? Yeah, that's... what I'm wondering. I don't know. Uh, Kurukawa, after Hatano's trial was over, haven't you gotten a little cold with me ever since? That's a subtle development you picked up there that I didn't pick up on. Yes. Don't know. Go to bed. That's what I'm saying. It's okay if you don't want to talk. It's late at night, so I'm ready to go into my private dorm. I'm a little worried, but Kurokawa isn't doing anything bad. I just hope she's not gonna be murdered this chapter. But technically, a lot of girls died, so I think it's time for some of the guys to die. Mm -hmm. Let's go to bed for today and work hard to investigate tomorrow. Yee, night time. This is progress. I was fortunate enough that everyone believed in me today. I'll remain in my room tonight and go to the dining room and eat tomorrow morning. And you also made a lot of progress with Uehara today. Yeah, when you're capped out, you get his underwear. So that means we definitely have the skill. Hmm. And I guess we don't have the underwear in here. I, I, I don't I don't know where any of this shows up. Huh. Anyway, let's uh, save our achievement. Yeah. I think that's hilarious. <laughs> He's just like, here, have my underwear ahead of time, but you can still give me a gift if you want, I guess. <laughs> I guess it's... Like, like alright, Urehara, my guy. Sure. What makes this funnier to me is, I don't know how much you know about Catholic priests, but, like, they're sworn to abstinence. Like, they cannot, they are not allowed to fuck. <laughs> they cannot have a relationship. They're just, they're, they're not allowed. <laughs> so I'm like, that's why this is hilarious to me. Because, like, he just handed Yuki his underwear. He's basically breaking his, his, his contract as a priest. I mean, does that count as, like... <laughs> stuff if you just give away your underwear? I don't think so. I would... My thing is, like, I would have to ask my grandma, and I don't want to, because then she'd be like, why are you asking this? <laughs> mm. A difficult so, situation. I think I... I think I will... 
refrain from getting a proper answer to that. But you know what is wonderful? Mm. I can name this part Uehara's underwear. It would be appropriate. Holy hell. Yes, it would. <laughs> That's a wonderful it took thing. Me out. <laughs> After Tomori and Hatano died, it was a little bit, but something started to grow between us. In the midst of those thoughts, I fell asleep little by little as well. Oh, it's already morning. I should have breakfast together with everyone. Let's go. I wanted to end the part! <laughs> but you know what? Whatever, I can just do it. Yeah, it's alright. We can get past this scene. Wait! This might be- this might go into the bo the bonus event anyway. Then that's a good thing. Since it is to... next day's, hmm. since this next day's bre breakfast. Then I shall end the part now. Next time we yeah. shall see the bonus event and whatever else the game will throw at us, I guess. Yes. So until then, goodbye.